Hey guys, my usual office space is actually uh, taken right now, so I have to make a video from my dining room. Um, so I'm going to be talking about the new iPod Touch, supposedly coming this September. So here are the LCD parts that have been leaked on the internet. And you can see that it has a front-facing camera, supposedly. Supposedly these are real. I think they're real, but they might not be. So some of the specs expected to be on the new iPod Touch this September are a 1 GHz processor, a retina display, front-facing camera, 5 megapixel back camera, gyroscope, and flawless support for iOS 4. What that means is that iOS 4 will run perfectly smooth with that 1 GHz processor, so it won't be laggy or you won't have like email taking 5 minutes to load like it is on the 3GS, um, which, you know, have videos have appeared all over the internet on that or the second generation iPod Touch. Even the, I believe the third generation has had some trouble with iOS 4. So a lot of people were disappointed when the third generation iPod Touch didn't have a camera on it. Um, I believe that those leaks on the internet were real, and I think they were prototypes, and I think Apple was starting to work towards getting a camera on the iPod Touch. This year, I strongly believe that they will put a camera on the iPod Touch whether it be a front piece and camera, a camera on the back, or both. Now, I would love to add this to my iDevice family, my iDevice collection, but we'll have to see how the iPod turns out. Um, also, the 3DS, which is featuring a 3D display as well as a 3D camera capabilities, seems pretty nice. So, this iPod Touch is expected to be released September 9th through the 16th, and will probably have a starting price of around $250. This is Jacob Heiser on the iPod Touch, and I'll see you later.